Okay, so I'm about to do a 60 PSI run test. Uh, made a couple of changes. It's a very, very simple uh, recirculating the exhaust back into the intake. Um, this is obviously going to get very hot, it's not very practical, so I'm going to have to do change this uh, intake box really, because uh, chances are this is going to melt, but you know, mm. we'll find out. Uh, the reason for this is to try and reduce the NOx emissions, uh, as this is the only emission when burning uh, pure hydrogen gas, it comes from the oxygen in the air. Uh, or nitrogen in the air and it's, when it's burnt it turns into uh, nitrogen oxide so it reduces that. It also, um, obviously the condensation and uh, the exhaust of hydrogen is, is water vapour so it cools and comes out as water in the intake and that cools, therefore cools the air intake going into the engine. So it's very primitive, very simple but it's just a, a pr proof, of, proof of theory really. Um, the carburetor is fully functional now so uh, when it's running 3 psi I have full throttle control, so I can rev the engine and use the engine as it would be uh, as if it was on petrol. So um, that will be also be interesting to see. But really, just going to see how long it runs on uh, 60 psi. Uh, I'm hoping you know for it to run on about six, seven minutes. Um, the aim is 10 minutes, um, so I'll do that by adjusting the carburetor as we go. And let's just see how see what happens really. Something else to point out as well is that for the engine to start efficiently when you first pull the engine cord, uh, it needs something that I call a kick. Uh, so what I use is isopropanol or some form or some form of alcohol. Drop a couple of drops of alcohol down the air and take literally tiniest amount. That just gets the engine going when you pull the engine for the first cycle, uh, and then the hydrogen just takes over from there. Uh, if I had an electric start on the engine, uh, I don't think this would be needed. Um, but just for now, to keep things uh, cheap and cheerful, uh, a drop of alcohol down the intake here gets the engine going nicely, which you'll see me do when I fire up the engine.
Okay, so you just saw this engine running. Uh, 50 psi lasted 10 minutes. That's uh, 10 psi for every two minutes. So now I'm just going to open up the engine, uh, look at the insides, and see how we can make that uh, last longer.